see this question okay so consider the given directed graph this graph is given okay so which of the following is our correct statements which of the following is our correct statements about this graph okay the graph doesn't have topological order okay so topological order is applicable okay topological order is possible only for directed acyclic graphs okay if graph is directed acyclic graph directed acyclic graph okay then only topological order possible topological order possible so only if only if directed acyclic graph if graph is cyclic our graph is undirected undirected graph by default uh, cyclic right assume there is a edge between a to b undirected undirected means a to b also b to a also undirected graph by default we can say cyclic okay so the graph must be directed and the cyclic then only topological ordering is possible topological ordering visit the vertex whose in degree zero and delete that vertex again visit the vertex whose in degree zero and again delete the vertex okay if the graph is cyclic there is a certain point there is no vertex whose in degree zero okay if the graph is cyclic so after certain point there may not be any vertex whose in degree zero okay and all the vertices of the graph is not at completed also that means topological order is not possible if it is a directed graph sorry directed cyclic graph okay undirected or directed cyclic graph topological ordering not possible topological ordering possible only for a cyclic directed graph right now in this graph if you observe there are some cycles okay this this portion of the graph have some cycle many more cycles are there okay this portion of the graph is also cyclic this portion of the graph is also cyclic okay so these are the three positions where cycle is there in the graph remaining positions this this the here not forming any cycle this not forming any cycle not form not cycle not form cycle these three places graph is a cyclic because of that even if one cycle is there topological order is not possible okay so topological order does not have the graph does not have topological ordering topological ordering because this graph is a cyclic so this is a true statement right second statement a dfs depth first search starting at vertex s assume this s is a source vertex okay starting at the vertex s okay if you go for dfs okay so three directed three directed edges as a back edge okay so every cycle of the graph every cycle of the in in the cycle okay every cycle of the graph guaranteed one back edge because of this cycle one back edge this because of this cycle one back edge this because of this cycle one back edge okay so if you apply directed graph okay so back edge dfs traversal okay dfs traversal over directed graph over directed graph okay so <clears throat> for each cycle of the graph for each different cycle of the graph one back edge okay it means number of cycles 
can be either greater than equal to number of back edges. Okay. Okay. So in DFS traversal over the directed graph for each different cycle there is one back edge. For each different cycle there is one back edge. For this cycle guaranteed one back edge. Okay. So for this cycle is become one back edge and for this cycle is become one back edge. But overall it may form one other cycle there may not be any back edge because that outer cycle outer cycle is already covered by two three inner cycles. Okay. Then what we can say that number of number of cycles number of cycles okay in DFS traversal of directed graph in DFS travers, uh, traversal of directed graph number of cycles greater than equal to okay DFS traversal of directed graph number of back edges number of back edges okay so we can say like this okay so number of cycles is becomes DFS tower greater than equal to number of okay so uh, back edges of the DFS traversal for example if you do DFS traversal for this one okay so a a adjacent is b visited okay b adjacent is c visited okay c adjacent is d visited c adjacent is d visited these are the three edges then this b to a this B to A is back edge and this C to A is also back edge. Okay. This D to A is also back edge. So these three back edges, these three back edges guaranteed represent one three cycles. Okay. So because of this back edge, this cycle. Okay. Because of this back edge, this cycle. Because of this back edge, this cycle. But overall these these three cycle covered one other cycle outer side that's why we say greater than equal okay but if it is if it is cycle in the different location okay cycle in the different places okay then number of cycles is number of back edges for example overlapping is not there these these three or four cycles in four different places in the graph okay then number of cycles is number of back edges so this is not overlapped cycles Okay, one cycle is not overlapping with other cycle. Okay, for this cycle one back edge guaranteed. For this cycle one back edge guaranteed. For this cycle one back edge guaranteed. Okay, so three back edges is in the uh, three for three cycles. Okay, for each pair of vertices U and V, there is a different path from. Okay, there is a directed path from U to V. For each pair, there is no directed path. For example, okay. For example, this this vertices, these all vertices from this set, these vertices, there is no reachability. From here to here, there is no reachability. Okay. So not not only this, not 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 only this. From this this to here, this to here reachability is there. But this vertex to here no reachability. This vertex to here no reachability. Okay. So these vertex to this vertex reachability is there. But this vertex to others no reachability. This vertex to others no reachability. If you if you think about strongly connected components, if you think about strongly connected component, these three are the three strongly connected component. The remaining only only this vertex is one strong connected component only this vertex one strong connected component only this vertex one strong connected component only this vertex one strong connected component so 2 3 4 5 6 7 strongly connected components okay so now so there is a path from both the ways is false okay the graph doesn't have strongly connected component this graph G not single strongly connected component. It is not single strongly connected component. Okay. There are. Okay. G has. Okay. G has. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 strongly connected components. Okay. 7 strongly connected components. 
सो नो स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट इज नेवर बी ट्रू नो स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट नेवर बी ट्रू एटलीस्ट वन वोट एक्स कैन बी ए वन स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट ओके वेन इट कैन बी ट्रू वेन इट कैन बी द पॉसिबिलिटी इफ इट इज नॉट ए सिंगल स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट इज यून दैट एंटायर ग्राफ इज नॉट सिंगल स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट ओके द फुल ग्राफ इज नॉट वन सिंगल स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट बट द ग्राफ हैज मेनी स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट ओके सो इफ दे से इफ दे से द ग्राफ डजेंट नॉट सिंगल स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट देन इट इज ट्रू बट ही सेइंग दैट नो ग्राफ डज नॉट हैव ए स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट इज नॉट ट्रू ओके ऑलवेज एटलीस्ट वन वोट एक्स कैन बिकम वन स्ट्रांगली कनेक्टेड कॉम्पोनेंट ओके सो देन दिस स्टेटमेंट इज ऑल्सो फॉल्स so answer to this question a and b right in this question it is involved about the topological order also and about the back edges edge classification also and about the strongly connected component concept also okay so right